gone away from Yara. He takes it on to Rout. And Dean Kiley in his first real league start of the season has to get it well away. Well, Adolto Rout has really led the way for, for QPR in this first half. He's started to tuck in a little bit, get hold of the ball and let shots fly like that. And Dean Kiley, it's a comfortable height for him. Good save, though, from the keeper, but to, to Rout really coming to the fore. The Corks has been so effective at uh, the defensive end of the spectrum for Queen's Park Rangers. Among the numbers thrown forward for this corner. You can see what Abdel Tarat is alleging. I presume he's saying that when he took the shot on that the defender just left his foot in a little bit, but disagreement there in the penalty area. A bit silly. Queen's Park Rangers take the lead. And West Bromwich Albion undone by a set piece. Well, isn't it always the way West Brom have really dominated the uh, opening stage of the second half, yet it's QPR that uh, opened the scoring and you wouldn't probably have expected it from a set piece. It's a cracking ball in. We talked about it. Is it an own goal, possibly? I thought it might have uh, come off for Casper's Gorts. As that ball comes in, I'm just wondering whether it comes off a... It's Olsen, isn't it? It comes off the back of Olsen's head and loops into the far corner. Here we get a good look at it. Is there a nudge in the back? It certainly comes off Olsen's head. And... Olsen hasn't got that one right either. And here comes Adel Tarat. A little pocket of space. Oh, what a shot. Touched onto the woodwork by Kylie. Fine save. And so close to being two up. They may yet be. Away by Nate. Here's Yara. West from the Jalbian creaking at the back. The Rangers absolutely flying. What a wonderful save from Dean Kylie. He's kept his side in the game. To Raps, I said, if you give him a chance to shoot from distance, he's really uh, disappointed. Does everything right at El Raps onto his left foot and absolutely smashes it. But look at the touch from Cali, what a wonderful save onto the crossbar. And Rangers, so so unlucky. It's a brilliant effort. And the goalkeeper, you've got to give him huge credit. That is a fantastic save. Watson for QPR, really good effort. Kylie did supremely well. Gorks, it's 2 0 now for Queen's Park Rangers. Casper's Gorks. Well, it just keeps getting better and better for Steve Gallen and Mark Burcham. It's all about the quality of the free kick that's delivered into the, uh, the West Brom penalty area. Dean Kiley has no answer. It's a wicked ball and it bounces just in front of the goalkeeper. Matic then gets a touch. It's a relatively simple chance for, for Gorks just to head into an unguarded net. It's about the quality, the pace on the ball that deceives uh, Dean Kiley. He can only just pop it up. Matic feeds Dorrance. It's up towards Brunt, good header down, here's Wood, really brave from Corks. Cox can't turn it, goalwards. They have one back through to Rowe Thomas. The West Bromwich Albion fight back begins. Level with Blackpool and Sheffield United, they will go. And they can see this through and they very nearly, oh so very nearly have now Queen's Park Rangers. Wood. Oh, is it going to fall for Chris Wood? Finds him by Jenny. 